Good morning. I've sat in my soft office. Um, Abraham and I had the loveliest morning. We cuddled in bed and we chatted and sang goofy silly songs about being stinky and he told me about all the dreams he had and I love I love mornings like that and then it always descends into chaos of him you know trying to like headbutt me or something. <laughs> he is going through a struggle right now. I think all of you parents can anybody with kids that have you know gotten to some age beyond two know that there's this real struggle of when when they really start to understand that there are like rules they have to abide by and he's just feeling very very grumpy the last two weeks that like he has to be polite he can't scream he can't headbutt he can't lift people's shirt up and blow raspberries on them he can't do things around the house that are really obviously going to break things or hurt himself and he's just he yelling at me all the time and we talked this morning about it um and i can hear from his perspective why he thinks he's being yelled at and it's such basic stuff it's literally like no you can't kick the window and break it no you can't try to pull my shirt off and laugh about it um no you can't go walk outside naked and say hi to the neighbors it's such simple stuff it's like just basic appropriate behavior and he's, he's still struggling with it. So that's our lockdown struggle of the week. Um, I did not post a lot last week because I did not feel well. I had a migraine from the pits of hell itself uh, that just took me down for the count. Oh my God, that was a vicious, it was such a bad migraine that I couldn't even sleep one night. Um, like the migraine just wouldn't go away enough for me to even sleep. So I just laid there in pain, you know, hoping that my medicine would kick in. So last week was quiet. Sorry about that. I know it's always kind of weird whenever a schedule changes. Um, today I have to shoot some videos. Um, and I had planned to get a whole bunch of errands done today. And I just don't, I just don't feel like getting it done. You know, the week has been too, too crazy for me. <laughs> I think I'm just going to hunker down. Um, and, and stick with that. It's not as sunny and fabulous as it's supposed to be. But I'm going to do some yoga today. Uh, we did a really good deep clean last week. Not a deep clean, a big like overview clean that was about two and a half hours of cleaning. Um, and I'm hoping to do that again today to a less degree, maybe like an hour solid because I need to do some floors and stuff. Um, so we'll see. We'll see how that goes. How was your week last week, Biscuits? Are you... Now we're, now we're into August. Oh my goodness. July, I feel like like poofed by it just went it was gone i don't know where july went um i had a project that was supposed to be in my mind you know it was my own set deadline done at the end of july and there i just knew like halfway through july i went oh there's just no way this month is just going too fast um so i'm hoping august is a fun month i'm hoping it's a warm month because next month september generally it starts cooling down here in the pacific northwest and we have not gotten a hot summer yet. Um, we've gotten a couple, we've gotten some hot days the last week or two, um, but for the most part, the summer has been really wet and cold. Like lucky to get 60 degree days as a high. Um, my skin is so dry. Oh, I can see it. it's like dry and red. I don't know what is going on. I'm gonna do a body lotion mask or something today because my skin is just I don't, I don't know what's going on. I changed up my lotion routine and I think that my my skin is paying for it. It's, my skin is so delicate, it's ridiculous. I was talking to my friend on FaceTime and they were making, you know, not making fun of me, but they were laughing. They're like, you're such a delicate snowflake because I was having bad allergies. And it's true, it's true, I am, I so am. Um, but we are gonna get this day to be awesome. I know I say that in every vlog, but I gotta say, I've hit the point of lockdown. Let me know if you have too. Um, they're like, the days are a bit of a struggle. I'm. A little bit done with lockdown. I'm still doing it, obviously, obviously, right? Save lives, be smart. Um, but it's just been a really long time, and between that and having to hide inside a lot from my allergies, I'm just so like the zest. The zest has kind of been <laughs> squaws, squaws out of me. Um, so I'm trying to come up with some fun things to do for the week um, that I think will kind of booster us back up and give us things to be happy and cheery about. And I have no idea what that is yet. Um, I fell down Martha Stewart's um, Instagram page and uh, Abraham and I had so much fun looking. She's got like lizards on there and grumpy looking cats. Uh, 
it's grit page oh my goodness i have the feeling i'm going to spend the next week just scrolling back through her instagrams going whoa the Mar bow down to the martha the national treasure no when people are superior to you clearly martha stewart is superior to Mua. i accept this <laughs> it's just funny when you find it at a social media account and you're like i'm just going to stalk this that that's how my week's going I am trying to get inspired for cooking. Bum, 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 bum. So I've gotten out some of my cookbooks, which I never do. I almost never cook from a cookbook, but my cooking has gotten so repetitive. Um, and I have had some crazy food versions of late where like food that I would normally be able to eat, I put on a plate and then I just can't eat it. So I am, I'm trying to come up with food that I think I can actually eat. Oh, my camera's beeping at me. Uh, that is new and different because I think even Abraham is bored of what we've been making in lockdown. Um, the downside of buying in bulk and not shopping very frequently. Okay, camera's yelling at me. I'm gonna go charge the camera. I'm gonna get some walk done in my soft office. <gasps> Shirts available in the merch shop. Oh yeah. Okay, let's get the dish started. Let's go. Boop, boop. Okay, so we are making pizza dough. I think I made it a little bit drier than I normally do, but easier to roll out. So I made a little bit of extra pizza dough that I turned into focaccia for lunch. This pizza dough takes a lot of time to rise. Get and I think, I think focaccia is done. My oven doesn't brown stuff very well on the top. It just doesn't. So I've had to learn that because otherwise I overcook things. But I made a really thin one with homegrown basil and then some other herbs sprinkled on top and a book a load of olive oil. So I think we're gonna eat that. Oh yeah. You want the beans. So far today has been a bunch of writing down notes and things and getting none of our other stuff done, so we'll see. Okay, please don't run over my feet. He's riding in a, uh, like a metal toy duck truck that barely, barely fits it. And he just keeps running me over with it. Ay, 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 but I think that that looks pretty good. Oh yeah, okay, we're gonna eat that. And then I can get shooting because I didn't want to shoot anything until I've actually eaten food because you can tell our homeschool table is actually being used right now. Look at that. We've got all this stuff that we're making. Geodes. I know. Every once in a while I clean it up, but today and yesterday we're actually like really using it and doing projects on it to keep them entertained. So I'm just letting it be. I'm just letting it be messy for now. Okay. Focaccia. Oh, I'm really hungry actually. I'm looking forward to that. I'm going to make a little bit of a uh, vinegar and fresh grated parm dip with a little bit of olive oil for the bread. We're going to fill our tummy. Thank you. He's coming to check on me, Biscuits. Yeah, because I love my mama. I love you too. Thank you. Why don't you go finish Boss Baby? See who wins the race, who gets the rattle. Everyone do. I oh, poor Boss Baby. Well, good, because that Boss Baby was me. Boss Baby. Watching the Boss Baby TV series. Oh. That's how mommy gets work done. Okay, I've got to get back to him. Ooh, itchy allergies. I went outside to water the plants, which I keep forgetting to bring the biscuits along on. <laughs> and oh, the pollen gets me. He is taking a rinse off because somebody played in the dirt and turned into mud. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, I did not end up feeling up for the pizza, so I think we'll do it tomorrow night. Um, he fell asleep and took a super late nap because <laughs> an early bedtime. Um, so it was just kind of like, ended up being too late to make these stuff. But it was nice to get outside, let them burn off some energy um, and all of that. I mean, I can't imagine I, poor parents that are going through lockdown in apartments or places with no yards. Because that is just, I mean, it's difficult enough just with our small yard. Um, it's so, it's so difficult. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Getting that, getting that energy out and trying to time nap time correctly. Mm -hmm. But I got some video shot. Um, so that's that's something to be be done. I will see you biscuits in the next vlog. I'm hoping as the week goes on that I feel better. I'm hoping it's just kind of zapping my energy feeling like this. I have to admit, um, it is not making me optimistic. Energetic, I guess energetic is a better word. It's not making me energetic. I just. Let's sit here on Netflix for the rest of the night is my plan. Hey, Biscuit, there's the blue towel. Make sure, you, oh, your legs and feet still need scrubbing. You didn't, and your chest, you didn't use any soap in there. You can't just rinse off, you have to scrub with the washcloth in there. Well, I always tell you. 
Okay, and biscuits. I will see you in the next video. It would make my heart so happy if you went and grabbed one of my seven novels to pass your time with. Because as soon as I feel better, I have to finish up um, one of the drafts that's due for that. Overdue? Yes? Shh. Don't. Oh, yeah. Don't wrap me out, man. Don't wrap me out. <laughs> Overdue for that. As soon as I feel better, I'm getting on that. So catch up on the books. One, two, and three are out in the Celeste Saga. Woo, woo, woo. Oh yeah. We also have our Paranormal Romance, which is Coven book out. That maybe, maybe there's going to be book two in the series coming out in time for Halloween. Mm -hmm. Only those in the know will know now. Oh, very mysterious. I need my own little magic fortune telling ball. I, I've always wanted those, I have to admit. Okay. You can tell. I'm tired. I will see you in the next video. I love you, Biscuits. Thank you so much for thumbs up in these, for always saying hi and sending messages and DMs and letting me hear from you because I love connecting. I will see you in the next video.